relevant to the surface chemistries. And uh, I was wondering, uh, the surface chemistry is one of the easiest chapters which one should not miss. Because the questions they ask are very straightforward and they involve no complication. They definitely ask one question in, at least one question in each exam in every year. In 2019 will also be like that. And also they can ask at least one question in IITG. In 2018, in the offline exam of IITG, they asked such a simple question, you know, which is wrong about uh, physical adsorption. And the wrong statement they gave is physical adsorption is unilayered. Physical adsorption is never unilayered, it is multilayered. Every Tom, Dick, or Harry can answer it. There is no complication at all. If you look at 2018 NEET exam, they asked a question like, the coagulating power of a particular ion depends on what? Obviously, the coagulating power of an ion depends on its nature of charge and magnitude of charge. Because, for example, you want to test it a uh, metal sulfide. Because metal sulfides get negative charge, you require a positive ion to precipitate it. More is the positive charge on the positive ion, and more is the very nature of the charge must be positive and magnitude should be more to present it that is so obvious and if you look at the questions asked in the last several years needs are so simple that any Tom Dick or Harry can easily answer them there is no complication at all with a little bit of planning and a strategy if you prepare just 50 percent of the portion you will be very sure to get 80 percent of marks in chemistry what you require is a strategy and you should focus on easy, easy chapters like, say, surface chemistry, metallurgy, for that matter, coordination chemistry, which carries four marks, less numericals. So one such easy chapter is surface chemistry. If you look at 2017, they ask you which statement is wrong about catalysts. Everybody knows a catalyst can't start the reaction. A catalyst can lower the energy of activation. A catalyst can uh, be very specific, so on. Now, the strong statement they uh, gave is the catalyst changes the equilibrium constant. They gave that is wrong. Catalyst can never change the value of equilibrium constant. Catalyst can never change the heat of the reaction. Catalyst can never change the amount of product. So, in 2016, they asked a question on coagulating power again. The coagulating power depends on the magnitude of charge, and you can see the answer straight by yourself. You know? So all these questions are very, very easy. For example, fog is an example. Fog is an example of aerosol. Even the liquid is, or sometimes even gas, it is burst in the gas. And they also ask about similar questions, which is fact about delta G, delta S for the adsorption. One question on Tyndall's effect has been asked. So, if you look at these questions are straightforward, you can easily answer and you will be the happiest person to answer them. So, I wish you good luck really. You will have no difficulty in answering, trust me. So, please stay focused and look at my videos and you can do a wonderful job. I wish you good luck.